So we've left our friend's house, um, Owen and Deirdre, where we camped up last night. Je Jasper slept in the tent last night. Yay! And we are <laughs> heading north along the east coast. We're going to drive up from Belfast all the way up the east coast. And um, it's supposed to be a beautiful drive up there. So we'll share that with you. Uh, the Giant's Causeway. And uh, we're also going, going to go and check out the Dark Hedges, which is one of the famous roads from the TV series, The Games of Thrones. So um, yeah, it's going to be a fun day. The weather is shining, as always in Ireland. It's beautiful, hot, sunny weather. We're in for a good day. It's thoroughly tropical, actually. So we've driven up, this is the beginning of the coastal road up towards the Giant's Causeway and we're just north of a town called Larn and the sea and the views behind us is amazing. Crystal clear water and really low waves and sunshine like this, who could ask for more? We're down at Bally Galley Slipway. We've just seen a couple of kayaks go off into the water. Um, seals dotted around in the bay. We are on the Causeway Coastal Road and it's just another glorious day. The rocks are just showing through the water because the water is crystal clear and you can see all the pebbles and stones because it's just absolutely stunning. You're probably bored of hearing us say it but come to Ireland, it's stunning. What's lovely is there are picnic tables with well-used barbecues. People are just out and enjoying it. There's a beach full of people just enjoying the sun. <laughs> that I could be brave Is there anything good on the radio? Turn it up loud and let me know How we used to be Before anyone heard of you and me We have found a beautiful spot for lunch right by the harbour Have a look at this So what a spot we had for lunch at Carn Lock. So we're leaving Carn Lock now and we're heading up the coastal road to a point called Tor Head. Look 
behind us, you can see the Molokan tire in the distance over there. Booyaka! Just fun bubbly boza. It's so hot at the moment that the roads are actually, the tar's actually starting to melt and you can hear it under the wheels that you drive along. I think that's pretty unusual for Ireland. We've just arrived at Torhead, glorious day, and we're about to climb up the hill, which is behind us. So let me do one of those Ta -da! It's well there. worth a drive down here. It's, on the, it's not far from sort of the Giant's Causeway direction, um, north, uh, east coast point of um, Northern Ireland. Stunning. Beautiful. On a sunny day, it's definitely worth a walk. Beautiful. Take it off. Oh no, it does. The film we've already seen got so high, so uh, no, oh, take it off. We're going higher. We're going higher. In fact, the plane up there in the sky actually looks like we're getting close to it. <laughs> it does. in Bally Castle on the way to the Giant's Causeway and it looks absolutely stunning. So we've stopped in Bally Castle because we decided it was time for an ice cream. Just a little one. Just How very naughty but it is hot it is like 30 degrees today so I think we've earned an ice cream. We climbed a moderate sized hill as well. So. We did climb a moderate sized hill. So I think that an ice cream is definitely on the menu now. Beautiful. Beautiful. But we should probably get out of the road before we all die. <laughs> I think we probably should. Honeycomb yeah. and raspberry and cream. Mmm, how very naughty. How's your ice cream, love? I think my eyes were slightly bigger than my tummy. She's packed it. I packed, she packed it. But it tastes amazing. It really is lovely ice cream. It's the Irish one, Maud's. Amazing. One of the local ones, beautiful. And I got Pooh Bear. So 
so we've just stopped off at White Park Bay on the North Shore and absolutely stunning looking beach it's packed with people there's jet skis down there people playing in the sea um, they're really making use of this wonderful the best of this wonderful weather that we're, we're having I did an emergency stop first checking there was nothing behind me because I have just found this most spectacular looking place and on the sign it says Dunsverick Castle or Dunsverick Castle I'm not quite sure how it's pronounced but look at this it's spectacular it's absolutely beautiful so take a look at this It says that Dunsaberic Castle is 5th century and apparently St. Patrick reputedly visited this castle and that it's actually an Iron Age building. It was built in the Iron Age. So that is spectacular. So we've arrived at the Giant's Causeway and it's early evening. Gorgeous. I think the visitor centre actually looks closed now. I think it closes at about six o'clock. The sun is just going down. And here's a tip. If you go to the hotel next door, buy a cup of coffee, you don't have to walk into the visitor centre. Just walk round it. The beach is a public beach. And they just charge you either for a lift down there or to go through the visitor centre. <laughs> towards the Giant's Causeway and I think this is so beautiful that I'm going to share it with you. Look above us. We've got the seagulls, the rocks and just an absolutely beautiful blue sky. It's just stunning. No, fan bubbly elastic. Fan that's the other way. Just beautiful. Behind us are just 
so beautifully lit up. Chris told me that this is like called golden hour, which is a really good time to take photos. But it's just stunning. And it goes all the way back there. There's another clump of rock formation just behind us here. Lots of people are on that one as well, taking photographs. But it's just stunning. where we like photographing different things and I have this little thing where I like to find flowers and I found some flowers don't tell him okay what I'll do is I'll get the drone up. yeah this is Chris filming me I'm trying to do a thumbnail and I need him to do a silly face you do a silly face Ooh. And we're sat on the rocks and it's utterly spectacular actually from here it's beautiful well we've just walked back to the giant causeway and it's a world heritage site for a reason what a strange natural structure absolutely fascinating um, we got there just at the right time, the sun's on its way down, um, we got the drone up, it's all absolutely beautiful and uh, it's a bit of a walk down there and a bit of a walk back but um, it's worth the walk so if you come to Northern Ireland you definitely have to come to the Giant's Causeway. Beautiful. Jess what do you reckon? Amazing. Amazing. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. Exactly, so we can have a little bit of a naughty dinner tonight on the way home. Um, it's about half past eight in the evening and it's still a beautiful sunny evening here in Northern Ireland. So we are here, this is the Dark Hedges, the Game of Thrones road and we are stood right on it. And amazingly, there's only one couple here um, before us which is 
which is amazing. So this is the road that was featured on the Game of Thrones. Um, and we'd want to share it with you. The light is beautiful this evening. The sun is just going down. It's golden hour. Look at that. Take your time.